Gold Lewis here in the room. Exciting stuff. Backpack is not alone. We might we might actually have the good fortune to see a mirror. Which, oh my uh, god! As, as we all know, is a 10-0 matchup. Yeah, the gold the gold Lewis mirror is so much fun to watch. Such big a meaty men slapping me. I, and I actually I saw Lolo at my last tournament. There was like so honestly it was so funny in our stream matches. We we have like back to back soul mirrors or, or not soul mirrors, uh, gold Lewis mirrors for like for like four straight matches. It was sick. <laughs> it was such a treat. It was such a treat to cast. I loved it. Did you and find it, that all the Gold Lewis players could like express themselves differently? Like, was it were, were there interesting styles on display? Um, I, I mean, it was it was interesting indeed because there are some you know Gold Lewis players. Oh, they definitely do have all a, the way through ooh, the drone. That is a bold move indeed. But I do I do notice some Gold Lewis players. You know, some of them might try to go for like the cross up game a little bit more, a little bit on the mix up side. The uh, others are a little Lewis. more. Um, aggressive, you know, with, with, with that coffin pressure, you know, mm -hmm. throwing in that drone, obviously, uh, to, you know, the drone just does neutral for Gold Lewis. Why wouldn't you throw that out, you know? I'm going to so, get I mean, an ulcer uh, watching Gold Lewis chip damage. Like, every time someone just straight up blocks Gold Lewis, I, I can feel it my, my it abs tighten involuntarily. <laughs> it, it does hurt. LK Boost sitting on very healthy blood meter can can get some real whack stuff going here with Gold Lewis in the corner. Yeah, yeah throwing in Counter a hit. lot of pressure here on the corner. Wow, oh, ending it with a perfect here. I always say I never realize these are perfects. You're like, oh, this is crazy. They're really fighting it out. I mean, this is a very rough match. And then you hear perfect and you're like, for real? Like... Yeah, I mean, well, it's it's a lot of back and forth. But, you know, at the end of the day, if they're blocking or they're not getting hit, you know, it's... You know, they 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 can put up a fight, but if you know if they're getting blocked, you know, some people. Yeah, it's hard to realize like what a dominant performance it was until the end. Like it was like, oh yeah, yeah. they were really in the corner the whole game. They were having a very like, tough time. Like personally, I don't play sixty dollars to hold hold back to block, but there's a lot <laughs> of other people fighting do. games, so... not blocking <laughs> games. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> so let's see, we're going to the next match here. I've never hit an FD but button in my life. I need that meter for <laughs> item super. <laughs> Like, oh, FD look. macro, what? <laughs> going in with that burst here, throwing in the drone, getting in the neutral, done! Throwing in that coffin pressure, trying to put LK in the coffin with that drone into the like, PRC. Nako is not a small man, but le look at his health, like even having to block these coffins. That is so tough. And then you imagine you know, you're somebody like heavy. Milia, for instance. It's heavy. And oh yeah, with Milia, it is brutal. Hundred percent. Not enough to kill. The guard crushed off the uh, blood rage pop. I mean, some people, some people joke that Gold Lewis is basically just heavy Milia. I mean, let's be real. Heavy. <laughs> you got the, the little, get the little coffin cross up there, you know. <laughs> Air typhoons are so sick. I love seeing the the big man helicopter. Ooh. They fall all the way to the corner. We have seen Lolo have a uh, a tough time against LK in the corner here. Throwing in the blood, mid. getting in the juggle. Those are some big old normals. All right, does drone get you out? Yes, it will. Oh, it will put Nako in the trapped corner. Trapped in the corner. You don't want to be there, but countering with that grab. Getting in the Fukio in the corner. Like Nako has all the blood meter in the world. He can. Uh, he's got like what four, five Fukios in there. He can get pretty whack. Yeah, he's got it. He's got it. Didn't beat the drone today. No. Listen, that that drone. You gotta respect that drone. It's very important. Back to was just showing off some whack drone tech that like made Gold Lewis weirdly plus in situations he normally wasn't. Like I think what it was like meaty drone or something. I I would have to look it up. I am. Uh, yeah. You know, I mean, it was a I thirty mean, second I, clip. <laughs> I mean, I think I think high key. Uh, Gold Lewis. Gold Lewis. I think Gold Lewis sits sits. It's like pretty is a pretty high tier character. I think he sits higher than more people realize. Like the security bar mechanic is interesting. It's I guess it's not as thoughtful as some of the other resources in Guilty Gear, but it is cool. Like I like that Gold Lewis have to think about it, but it does seem like drone is very much the dominant option compared to a uh, minigun in a lot of cases. Oh yeah, hundred percent. I mean, minigun's good if you want to get some last minute chip damage if the if the opponent's at like very low health, um, just to finish them out from a di from a distance. But apart from that, you don't see it too much. I see a minigun used a lot in the, in the Gold Lewis v Happy Chaos matchup for sure. 
just ends I up being a drunk battle. I've seen it a lot in uh, funny videos on the internet. Yeah, that too. Love those. Oof, Going in with that sweep. Let's see what we got here going into the next school. Starting in with that Beyblade sleep across. Yeah, very the early coast. to be in the corner. A tough situation. I mean, that's the thing with Nago. Nago skips neutral and puts you in the corner fast. You got to. Yeah, you can really... force you into the corner on block, which is tough. You're like, uh, I always talk about like good players move in such a way that they never even get put in bad situations or like they minimize it because it's like yeah some characters if they even put you in block stun you're already playing their game you're already at a disadvantage so you know you have to move as annoyingly as possible to uh you know prevent that and you see Koldo is going in for the sweep there all right post drone pressure Nago's in the corner oh big old normals Ooh, He's got yeah, throwing in here, the big beefy Nago normals into the corner Goldo is throwing in that drone you gotta respect it Nago Going Million. in with that mix-up. Backdash to the Typhoon, but he's given up a lot of screen space. He's probably one hit, though. He's about to take that gold Lewis damage. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, punish. catching that burst bait. You hate to see it. Trying to gain more pressure. Replying with the other PRC going PRC in with in that red RC. Face. Finishing it out. I wonder wow. what gold Lewis had PRC'd. Yeah, I, I, I do not, I do not remember. Evidently, he probably started up a normal and, and did not wish to. But yeah, probably. You know, he probably was. realized he made a mistake, mashed that PRC button to try to correct it, but it just wasn't enough in time. Let's see. Here. I do love. Uh, I, I like this RC system quite a bit. I do love seeing people use it for like creative movement, like especially for. You know, big body characters who might have restricted movement. Like it's like, oh, you you could you know you still have an air dash. You just have to use blue RC. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, you 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 technically do still. Yeah, I mean, it definitely gives a lot more options, um, which I I really do appreciate seeing. Um, yeah, ooh, I mean, there's certainly some strong options, but I do love seeing people get get creative and a bit nutty with it. Oof. Ooh, ah. Look at that aerial juggle across the freaking map. Look at that. All the way into the wall right. I don't think it kills, but Gold Lewis is uh, very sad off of the back of that. Yeah, yeah. Gold Lewis, Gold Lewis got that gut. Oh, look at the blood meter, though. Yeah, Ooh, yeah. Ooh. Unfortunately, gotta... uh, he was not thirsty. Ooh, going in with that jab. Calling out the Fukio, going into... Throwing Nago into the corner with that drone. Again, you gotta respect it. Keep going all day and drain it, draining Nago's offensive options by forcing him to FD here, because you do not want to take that gold Lewis chip. I cannot believe that killed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no Listen, those coffin yeah. attacks are beefy. They are beefy. You don't you do not want to get hit by those. When you get hit by those, you're 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 getting caught in that coffin juggle, you're in the ground. You're getting hit by the entire weight of the American defense budget. <laughs> the entire weight, indeed. Nago sitting on uh, a fat old blood meter here. He cannot afford, uh, you know, too many more Fukios off that. Yeah, I gotta let it drain. Ooh, throwing in that drone. Drone, gotta watch oh, for drone oh, getting juggled. Ooh, look at that! Throwing in that Beyblade combo. Ooh, PRC calling out that jab with the grab. I would have got hit by that. I would have expected command grab. Oh, 100 percent, me too. That was that was a sharp call. Ooh, burst off the last pixel of health. Can't go close to. Oh, oh gold burst punish. Yeah, that was that was definitely. Oh, jabbing him though. Huff, slight mistiming. Could not uh, get Nago to block. Yeah, no, that was that was that was rough. Yeah, calling it out with that jab like that. <laughs> I really, I was really impressed with the, with the, with the RC into, you know, the jab. Um, it's just kind of calling out the other player. That was, that was really interesting. Yeah, they had had enough of being in each other's faces. You're like, you know what? I don't even, I don't even want to do a combo. Just get out my face.